have to come to the round up. The club of Indian women reflect the ethos of empowering women and celebrating Indo-US relations to the same. In its 14th year of continuous service to the community, an anniversary get-together was organized. In an attempt to socially collect homebound women and create a socially interactive sphere for them, the Club of Indian Women in Chicago was founded 40 years ago. We have been around for 40 years. A lot of women have taken part. We have done good things for the women of Chicago area. Indian immigrant uh, families were alone in 70s and that's, that is the time few women get together and started this association. It is an amazing milestone. And when I first met uh, the president and uh, other board members when they came to invite me, I uh, you know, I thought that it is a social club. Uh, I was not aware because as you all know, I am still very new in Chicago. I arrived last year. But when I went through their entire list of activities and what all they do, I was simply, uh, you know, taken aback. I mean, I was amazed at all the work that they have been doing. CIW enriches the lives of members through participation in shared experiences that encourage cross-cultural exchange and friendship. What was there? We didn't have any social media. <laughs> so we had to meet socially. Okay. And that is what brought us together. Mm -hmm. And till now we are together mm -hmm. and we have done such wonderful programs in the past. This country, 40 years ago, most of the women felt homebound and had children, small children, this was a way to get them out of there and meet other women and share your experiences and feelings. And, uh, and we tried and uh, they just responded like anything and we were, you know, till today we are getting more people, till today 40 years but we have always added more people to it. We had so much chemistry, all three of us that we didn't think, we just did. Mm -hmm. And we wanted to be independent, mm -hmm. you know, we wanted to feel our um, power, our dignity. Mm -hmm. And at that time we didn't work, we didn't do anything, we had kids, we were homebound, there was no cell phones. Mm -hmm. You know, it was a whole different world 40 years ago. So we just decided that we were gonna meet once a month and that in itself was such an ordeal. You know, we have stories that we can tell where we had, um, you know, lots of fun. New members are welcomed warmly into a diverse group that respects all cultures, enjoys all personalities, considers all viewpoints, and fosters a network of deep friendships, transcending cultural and national differences. This is an organization centered on the growth and um, awareness for women and families and how to take care of the spiritual self and I think the reason I've been called is because the organization is focused on the growth and well-being, the inner well-being of its members. The event was a wonderful way to salute the intent with which this organization was founded and continues to strive over the years. Under the banner of Global Peace Foundation, professional men and women from various cultures, races, religions and societies